This is exactly how I helped my client to feel absolutely worthy of love. And so if you are in the relationship niche, listen up because this is going to really help you um, better your client results and improve the impact that you're already making for your clients. And so in ACH sessions, we always, always, always start off with what is the problem. And for this particular client, as uh, she mentioned in the testimonial, she had a lot of longstanding issues with regards to feeling, um, feeling insecure in her relationships and um she didn't feel safe being herself. And so what happened was that we just explore that just by asking what's the problem, right? And based on this client's response as to exactly how she feels when she's being herself, we explore that uh, very, very deeply. And when, you know, things came up, some themes with regards to whatever metaphors that she used, I usually just jump on those metaphors um, that she has given if she went to a scene or a memory from her past, we explore that. But within the session, the main goal was just allowing the client to give us the unconscious moment that their unconscious mind to delivery deliberately gives us uh, to facilitate the breakthroughs. I did come into the session and say, okay, you feel worthy of love. Let me get out my, you are lovable or you are good enough script. No, no, there was none of that. What truly happened was just, I was just curious about this client's problem as to how it was affecting her current relationships uh, with her children, with wanting to open up to a new relationship and the knots and beliefs about herself and relationships and everything else her mind has, has, has associated with this particular problem we explored in the 60 to 90 minute session that we had. Um, and because of that, afterwards, with some processing, she was able to give me this amazing testimonial of, you know, saying that she now feels um, more valuable and worthy of love. And um, this way, the, because of this, it really impacted the way she interacted with her children, her relationships, and everyone around her. And this is really, this is truly what makes this work um, very um, inspiring, right? Very fulfilling. Uh, because for my part, as a practitioner, I didn't have to prepare, I didn't have to stress myself out, I didn't have to put pressure on myself to deliver this, this result. Because I knew the principles to work with, as well as that I have developed this trust in my client's unconscious mind and their ability to help solve the problems, which really developed from using a methodology that does not rely on scripts, on recordings or transformation recordings, on timeline therapies or aggression or whatever, whatever else. All it does is relies on utilizing the unconscious moments that our clients give Give us throughout our hypnotic interview and this is why we teach this for hours and hours on end in ACH trainings because once you're able to um, really be confident with just the investigation phase you don't need the scripts you don't need the regression you don't need the inner child you don't need the visualizations because you're just able to have your clients break through and stimulate um, the unconscious mind to start processing a new change, a new way of thinking, feeling, believing, and acting with regards to whatever your client's issues are. And so, you know, super grateful. And, you know, when, when you start um, practicing ACH, the, the testimonials like this are very, very common. Well, when your clients say, I've worked with a lot of therapists and experts and, and you become the, the go-to, you stand out because you're really just um, not making them do anything. You're not telling them what to do. You're using what they're telling you and allowing for their unconscious mind to do the work, which is a lot more powerful uh, than using the traditional techniques, um, which I used to do, but so happy that um, it's less pressure now and I'm more confident in delivering results, which is a win, 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 right?